What is cholera? Cholera is a disease caused by bacteria that produce a toxin that makes you have diarrhea. This is when you need to poo a lot and you poo a lot of water too. It can be one of the signs of traveler's diarrhea. Sometimes cholera can make you feel sick and vomit. If you do not get treatment for cholera, it can kill you in a few hours. People who make your food or drinks might not wash their hands, and if they have poo on their hands, then this can get into your food. If you eat the food or drink with poo on it, then this is how cholera gets into your body and makes you sick. This is more likely to happen if you are traveling. How to avoid cholera? Drink clean bottled water and wash your hands with soap and water after the toilet and before eating. Eat and drink in places where they have clean kitchens and people wash their hands with soap and water before preparing your food or drinks. This means you might want to avoid street food. Can you protect yourself with a cholera vaccine before you travel? Yes, there are two cholera vaccines in the UK now, which can help protect you from getting ill with cholera when you travel. You can get them if you're an adult or child over two years old. One is called Ducaral and the other one is called Vaxcora. They are both prescription only medicines and you need to speak to your travel health doctor, pharmacist or nurse to check that you can have the cholera vaccine before you travel. What is the difference between Ducaral and Vaxcora? Ducaral is a vaccine with a dead cholera bacteria and toxin inside. Vaxcora is a vaccine with a weak bacteria inside, but it's live. How many doses of Ducaral do you need to help you be protected from cholera? Adults and children over six years old need two doses, and children between two and six years old need three doses. How do you take Ducaral? Ducaral is a drink. You need to have an empty stomach at least one hour before taking the vaccine and for one hour after you have it. This means no food or drinks for one hour before you take the vaccine and no food or drinks for one hour after you have the vaccine. You need to mix the Ducaral powder and liquid in cool water, not hot water or ice water, and drink it for one dose. Your doctor, pharmacist or nurse might do this for you. If you are an adult or child over two years old, you need to take Ducaral again in one week. If you wait longer than six weeks to take Ducaral again, it will not count as your second dose and you'll need to start again with your first dose. If you are a child between two and six years old, you need to take one week after your second dose and take your third dose. If you wait more than six weeks, then you need to start all over again with your first dose. When should you take Ducaral? You need time to take your Ducaral so that you finish all the doses at least one week before you travel. For example, if I'm an adult, I will need two doses of Ducaral. This means I take one dose today, then one dose seven days later. Then my trip can be seven days after this. How do you take Vaxcora? You take one dose of Vaxcora, which is a drink. Again, you need to have an empty stomach at least one hour before taking the vaccine and for one hour after. This means no food or drink for one hour before you take the vaccine and no food or drink for one hour after the vaccine. You need to mix the powder of Vaxcora with cold or room temperature water, then drink the mixture. Again, your doctor, pharmacist or nurse will do this for you. Adults and children over two years old only need one dose of Vaxcora. And there is no information about when you should take Vaxcora again to help you stay protected from cholera. When should you take Vaxcora? You should take Vaxcora at least 10 days before you travel. If you take Vaxcora, you need to make sure you wash your hands with soap and water every time you go to the toilet, especially if you live with other people. Who cannot take Vaxcora? There are three reasons why you might not be able to take Vaxcora because it is a live vaccine. One, if you take medicines or have a health condition that lowers your immune system. Two, if you have an allergy to some sugars like lactose or a health condition that affects how your body processes some sugars like galactose or fructose. And three, if you have taken any antibiotics by mouth or had injections or infusions of antibiotics in the 14 days before you get the Vaxcora vaccine. Always speak to your doctor, pharmacist or nurse to check if you can get any vaccines such as Vaxcora or Ducaral. Can you take Vaxcora with chloroquine? 
you should not take Vaxcora at the same time as chloroquine. If you get Vaxcora, you should wait 10 days, then you can start taking chloroquine. Can you take Vaxcora and typhoid vaccine capsules at the same time? If you get the Vaxcora vaccine, you need to wait two hours before you take a typhoid vaccine capsule, which has TY21A in it. Can you take a cholera vaccine drink at the same time as getting vaccine injections? Yes, you can get vaccine injections at the same time as drinking a cholera vaccine drink, such as Ducaral or Vaxcora. Do you need a cholera vaccine certificate to travel? No, you do not need to have a cholera vaccine certificate to travel unless it is a requirement of that country. When do you need to get a booster dose to help you stay protected against cholera? You can get a booster dose of Ducaral within two years of getting your first two or three doses of getting the Ducaral vaccine. At the moment, there is no information about getting a booster dose of Vaxcora. To find out more about the cholera vaccine, you can read the UK Green Book, chapter 14. I will link to this in the description box below. And I've also included other links from Travel Health Pro and Fit for Travel and the World Health Organization for you. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Thank mm -hmm. you.